Former Northern Regional Chairman of the New Patriotic Party, NPP, Daniel Bugri Nabu, has acknowledged the authenticity of a leaked tape outlining a plot to remove the Inspector General of Police, Dr. George Akufut Dampare, from his position. Testifying before a special parliamentary committee investigating the matter, Bugri Nabu confirmed that a voice on the tape was indeed his own. He disclosed that a recording captured a conversation between himself and three other high ranking police officers. Several weeks ago, an audio recording surfaced containing a conversation allegedly involving Daniel Bugrinabu, a former Northern Regional Chairman of the NPP and some senior police officers. The conversation purportedly discussed a plot to remove Inspector General of Police Dr. Akufudampari. In response to the emergence of the tape, the minority group in Parliament called for an investigation to verify the tape's contents. The Speaker of the House responded by forming a seven-member special committee. In a committee session, Bugri Nabu, a former Northern Regional Chairman of the ruling New Patriotic Party, provided his testimony confirming the tape's contents. Apart for Commander Asari, uh, there was one man also later joined called Commander uh, C.O.P. Mensa. Okay. That he's on leave now prior to his retirement. That he was also part of it. Yes. Mm. So you were only three? Then later, when the meeting were going on, one, I didn't see the person. It was on phone. One, uh, get, get me. JP, who is also a, a police superintendent at the police headquarters. But I haven't seen him. He, he, was, he talked to me on phone, and uh, I listened to him on phone. OK. So where is the location of your office where this place, I did that, the taping took place? Uh, my office is at Osu. Osu. And get direct opposite Osu Police Station. So you want to tell this uh, committee that all that was said on the tape is valid? Oh, it's valid. Okay. Bugri Nabu, who now holds the title of Paramount Chief of Namong in the Northeast region, elaborated to the committee on his efforts to dismiss the approaches made by the police officers. Did you tell um, this? individual called Commissioner of Police, uh, Mensa, that what he's trying to do is not right. Did you tell him? Mr. Chairman, the first time he, he came, no, if he was sensible, he would know that I was dismissing him. Because mm. he came to my office once came to my house once. Finally, I told him that after leadership, I told him finally after leadership is God gift. It's not cutting people. So you should go and see Chief the Mam, or if you want, you should go to uh, Saint Eugene or my king, my king. So I do pray for him, so that God will. If you say God say you'll be a, a IGP, you will be. That was what I called. They should go and see Malams. This was my last uh, word I could buy them. Upon the conclusion of the proceedings, committee chairman Atachia expressed the committee's readiness to consider evidence from all sides, including the three police officers allegedly featured in the tape. So far, we released him to go. Would you say you are satisfied with the responses from him? Well, um, hey, I don't have to judge the issues now, as I keep saying. Because at the end of the day, you need to listen to everybody. And then, and then we'll be able to understand the full complement of the evidence. As the committee commenced its work, the minority group conveyed their gratitude to the speaker and urged the committee to conduct a thorough investigation. It's very, very clear that the authenticity of the tape, that indeed this happened, that indeed there was an occasion where this tape was recorded, 
And so I think that it confirms the worry I had. And I wish the committee well. I believe that they will get to the bottom of these issues uh, and to make sure that uh, all the fears of the people of Ghana who have listened to this tape are addressed. I mean, it should not happen in Ghana that people who have been entrusted at the highest levels to basically protect and safeguard the interests of the people of Ghana and the stability of this country in terms of security, especially when it comes to elections, see themselves as basically working in the interest of a political party to basically ensure a certain outcome. The work of the special seven-member committee set up by the Speaker of Parliament to investigate the leaked Dampari tape is now in full swing. A key witness, Chief Bugirit Nabu, a national council member of the governing New Patriotic Party, um, has had his time with the committee. He has authenticated um, everything that was said on that tape. He said that he actually recorded the tape. Now, on Thursday, three other persons head on the tape, um, Commander Asari, um, Commissioner Mensa, and Superintendent Asari, all police officers who were head on the tape with Chief Bugri Nabu are scheduled to attend the committee meeting. My name is Charles Osukumi. I've been reporting from Parliament House for City News.